Want to level up your music's online presence with a website? I truly understand. Even world-class pop stars like Taylor Swift, Billie Eilish and Bruno Mars have one. Welcome to Hostinger Academy and I'll show you how to make a music website in a super simple way. While well, social media is a must, you shouldn't rely on it alone. Instead, consider building a website to act as your headquarters. This way, you'll have a full control over your image and branding. Plus, websites come with a ton of powerful tools for merch and music, like analytics, inventory management, marketing tools, and much more. And the best part is, you don't need any coding skills at all to create a music website. But before we start, let me remind you to subscribe to this channel and turn on your notifications so you won't miss tutorials like this in the future. All right, let's dive into the first step. These days, you can find a ton of beginner-friendly website builders out there. These come with everything you need, from easy-to-use site editors to AI SEO tools and even e-commerce stores. Hosting your website builder has all of that and more and we'll be using it for this video. First, you'll need to purchase a website builder plan to access the tool. It comes with everything you need to build a website, hosting, the builder itself, and a domain name. Click the link to this landing page I have included in the description below. You'll see two different plans to power up your website. The premium website builder plan lacks e-commerce functionality, but you can always upgrade to the business plan later. Let's go with a business website builder plan for this video. I'll also pick the 48 months bundle to get the best deal, which includes a three month subscription and a free domain name. Now create a hosting account with your email address or simply connect your Google account. Then pick any payment method you like. As a Hostinger Academy viewer, you're also eligible for the WB10 coupon code to get an extra 10% off. Complete the payment and we're off to the next step. You'll be redirected to the website builder and asked how to build the website, whether with AI or a pre-built template. If you choose AI, all you need to do is click this button, enter your website name, choose the website type, and explain the overall concept. After picking your preferred style and color palette, the AI will generate a website according to your prompt, and you can tweak the content afterward. If you'd rather just pick a template, there are more than a hundred designer made ones available, so you're sure to find something that fits you. Since we're going to create a music website, let's pick one from the entertainment category. You can pick any template you like. I'm going with this one. Then we'll get to the site editor area where we can customize all the website elements. By default, the template already provides us with essential pages like home, merch, music, news, gallery, and about. If these pages match your website design plan, the next step is just as simple as replacing the site elements with what you need. To change any text, image, or button placement, simply drag and drop the item to the area you want. If you want to change the background, click Edit Section to edit or remove the image. To edit the headline, double-click on the item and replace it with the text you want. In fact, you can make use of the AI Writer tool to help create headlines or copy. Just head to the AI Tools menu, describe your text, wait for the tool to generate it, and then copy and paste. Now, if you want to remove an item, for example, you don't want to use a CTA here, click the Option button and select Delete. To add new site elements like images, videos, or text, choose one from the Add Elements menu. As for the overall style, Nyquist is a template designed for the fictional alternative punk band. But maybe your music is more poppy and you want a brighter color palette for the entire site. No worries, let's navigate to website styles and change it up. To make everything even more uniform, you can head to the Fonts tab and pick out something that resonates with your music. Don't see anything you like? You can create your own by clicking Edit Text Styles. Next, let's move to the Music section on the homepage. You can see the full album and single sections showing the cover images and titles. Simply replace the image and text with your own and click Edit Image. Then the Action tab to set an action when visitors click on the image. For example, let's choose Open Link to redirect our audience to our album page by choosing it from the drop-down menu. 
You can also edit your social media links by clicking Edit Social Icons and choosing Edit by clicking the gear button. If you want to replace a social media platform with another one, just hit Delete and click Add a new link. Now, you can use the same process to edit all the other site elements. If you want to edit, add, or remove other website pages, you can do that from the header or Pages and Navigation menu. Make sure to review how your site looks on mobile devices by clicking the mobile icon and make any needed adjustments from there. If you feel like you're stuck, there's also a handy AI chatbot to help you navigate the site builder. Next up, I'm going to show you how to add more features to your site. Now, you'll probably want a store to sell your albums or merchandise too. In case your chosen template doesn't include the store function by default, you can add this function by opening the settings panel and choosing online store. Note that you have to choose the business website builder plan for this feature. Here, you'll be instructed to complete the store setup wizard to enter the store management area. This one single dashboard lets you add and remove products along with managing the payment and shipping options. I won't dive too deep into this functionality as we have a separate video for that. If you need a guide, make sure to check out the video here. If you want to sell concert tickets, you can follow this default layout from the template. As most ticket selling is managed with another platform, you can simply link the ticket page to CDA buttons like this. If you want to change the name from news to something else, just click the gear icon and select rename. One important benefit of incorporating a blog page is SEO which helps your visibility on search engines. To help you out, hosting your website builder provides SEO features that you can access from these settings. Simply follow every instruction and ensure you turn these yellow marks to green. To make it even easier, try the AI SEO Assistant to get a head start on your SEO journey. Once you're done tweaking all the site elements, your music website is ready to launch. Before publishing the site, check the content, appearance, and overall navigation experience by clicking Preview. One more thing, don't forget to claim your domain name, otherwise your site will go live with this randomly generated name. Simply hover over this part and click Connect Your Own Domain. You'll be redirected to HPanel to claim the free domain name. Once that's done, go back to the website builder and click Go Live. And that's it. Your site is now online and ready to promote your music. To wrap it all up, here's a final tip for your website promotion. You can generate a QR code of your website. This way you can easily share your website through leaflets and stickers, which are commonplace in music festivals. To do so, go to the pages and navigation, choose which page you want the QR code to link to, and click the gear icon beside it. I recommend using the home or about page. Customize the code as you want and click download when it's ready to add the QR code to your music's promotional materials. Awesome! You now know how to build a music website. If this video has helped you out, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Turn on your notifications so you won't miss any video tutorials like this in the future. We upload new videos every week. Thanks for watching and good luck on your online journey.